Okay, so here's an update on my homemade UAV project. Uh, what's new since last time? Well, a fair bit. Uh, what do we have? So we've got the uh, airframe over there. We have the transmitter over here with its uh, PS2 controller. Uh, it was the same as last time. That operates just like an ordinary remote control. I've tried, etc. Um, however, uh, UBIT is control panel over here. Uh, we have uh, battery information for the uh, transmitter and receiver. Uh, this gives us uh, this, these bars here tell us signal strength. This is a cool bit. Uh, this is uh, um, sort of like artificial horizon. Let me see if we can get a plane display in the shot at the same time. So now if I tilt the plane left, you can see the artificial horizon move. Um, what else? This is actually a throttle indicator. I haven't really yet uh, done much work on it yet, but it'll tell us how many amps the uh, motor is drawing eventually. See that needle moving. Stop that. Um, okay. Yeah, so um, my the inertial measurement unit I've been building on the plane sort of uh, tells me which way uh, the air aeroplane is pointing. Woo, all the way over. There we go. So, what else? Does that, uh, what else do those sensors let me do? Now, if I hold this button in on the control, it acts as a bit of an autopilot. So, autopilot paddle now held in. So, let's try that again. So now, when I tilt the plane left, the rudder turns right. When I tilt the plane right, Rudder turns left and simulate with up and down. If I pump the nose down, the uh, elevator points up. I want to point it up the way. Elevator points down. I see my kitchen better than the plane there, really. Ah, screw it, you get the idea. Woo! clear. Straight down shot on top of the rudder, that'll work. So let's lean over. Yeah, there you go. You see that deflecting. Plane's leaning all the way off left. So it's giving right rudder. Plane's pretty much stable. It's in the middle. And so it leans off that way. Or it goes the other way. There you go, happy days. And all that is being displayed on the uh, screen as well. Just made that display to help trouble, sort of uh, tuning and troubleshooting. I um, haven't actually tried flying and looking at the display at the same time yet. Um, eventually, I might put a little camera on the front of the plane and sort of display what's, uh, what the plane's actually seeing out the front here. Quite a cool way to record flights. Anyway, that's about it. Bye.